the midday office for June 30th. Hallelujah. Praise God in His holy temple. Praise Him in the firmament of His power. Praise Him for His mighty acts. Praise Him for His excellent greatness. Praise Him with the blast of the ram's horn. Praise Him with the lyre and the harp. Praise Him with the timbrel and dance. Praise Him with strings and pipe. Praise Him with resounding cymbals. Praise Him with loud clanging cymbals. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Lord, hear my prayer, and in your faithfulness heed my supplication. Answer me in your righteousness. My eyes are fixed on you, O my strength, for you, O God, are my stronghold. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel from age to age. Amen. Amen. The midday reading is taken from the Epistle to the Ephesians, chapter 3, verses 20 through 21. Glory be to him whose power working in us can do infinitely more than we can ask or imagine. Glory be to him from generation to generation in the church and in Christ Jesus forever and ever. Amen. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel from age to age. Amen. Amen. The midday psalm is taken from Psalms chapter 20 verses 1 through 5. May the Lord answer you in the day of trouble. The name of God of Jacob defend you. Send you help from his sanctuary and strengthen you out of Zion. Remember all your offerings and accept our burnt offerings and sacrifices. Grant your heart's desire and prosper all your plans. We will shout for joy at your victory and triumph in the name of our God. May the Lord grant all your requests. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel from age to age. Amen and amen. Glory be to God the Father, to God the Son, and to God the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it is now, and evermore shall be. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. Almighty God, you have built your church upon the foundation of the apostles and prophets, Jesus Christ himself being the chief cornerstone. Grant that all of us may be joined together in unity of spirit by their teaching, that we may be made a holy temple acceptable to you through Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God now and forever. Amen. O God, the source of light, shed your unending day upon all of us who watch for you that our lips may praise you, our lives may bless you, and our worship may give you glory through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen.